Welcome back to my channel, guys. It's your girl, Coco Styles. And on this channel, we talk about beauty, fashion, lifestyle, guys. So, listen. Today, I have my, my new aligners. Um, I think the last update I did was week 20... 22, maybe? Maybe 20... Uh, not 22. Maybe 20. Because the last five are my retainers for the last set. So, I went back to the dentist, to the orthodontist, and um, I did get 10 more trays. 10? Thirteen more trays. So basically, ten trays are actual spark aligners, and then the other three are the retainers. So I will say this: I like Spark. Um, I think I said this before. The reason why I like Spark is because I don't know. It's just a bit more. Um, it was the color of the aligners were clearer than the Invisalign. Um, I, they, I assume that they work the same, but I've said this before, I didn't have any real pain. I can count the times on one hand, and it probably was twice, to be honest. Um, so I'm on, um, I am on tray one now, so my slurring is kind of back, guys. Oh my God, so annoying. Um, so here are all the trays that I have for this set. Let me come a little closer. It's so bright. I don't know if you guys can see that. Uh oh. I don't know if you guys can see that. Um, but the first one I already did. Of course, they still give you the little chewy thingies. Um, which is crazy because this set that I have in, I didn't need to use them. What I did notice was that the bottom right corner. Um, it was a little bit longer, so it clawed my teeth more. Um, I'm not sure if that has anything to do with them trying to move one of these over here on the side. <laughs> um, so I'm gonna come uh, just a little closer, guys. Don't judge. This, I have them on right now. This tooth, which one is it? This huh? It's always, <laughs> it's always been kind of like push back very slightly but I think that has a lot to do with me sucking my thumb as a child so it kind of gave my teeth kind of like a rounded shape opposed to like really straight my mom had like perfect teeth my god they were just like the best um so that's what we're gonna work on now there was a little bit of spacing after the top and the bottom adjusted so he didn't want any spaces I think I said before they call it the black triangles so now I can see the trays um, through the packets and actually let me move these in the back here. I can see the trays in the packet and I can actually tell on the last tray, somebody is calling me, on the last tray that um, they're gonna be like really, 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 really nice. I hope you guys can't hear that buzzing. So let me see. I'm not gonna open it, but, cause I don't wanna, but I can tell that they are going to be like a straight straight from what I can see here. And you guys, I know you can't see it cause this is really, I know you can't see it cause the, the, the words are on there, but I can tell that looking at the aligners cause I was able to tell the last time that I was going to need more um, so in total, the first was 25, but the last five were just retainers. And honestly, I didn't even use them all um, because my aligners came in early. And also, so that was 25 the first time, but technically only 20. So in total, since three are retainers, a 30 trays in total. And I change them every week, guys. So. I think this was pretty good for someone who had slight adjustments needed. Um, I'm gonna give you guys a couple of updates on this set, not too many, and then the final, final, final reveal of my new teeth. 
Um, the lady who put on, she, they did have to add more attachments, um, which I was like, oh my God, please don't let them be on my front teeth. And they weren't. <laughs> but I kind of felt like the first girl did a better job. I don't know, I had like some grit that it felt. So I just kind of flossed that out or whatever. Um, so now I'm more concerned with when they come off, how is that going to be on my teeth? And, you know, what do I have to do and stuff to keep them nice and pretty, guys? So, um, let me know if you have any questions on Spark Aligners. I'm definitely here to help. Um, if you are looking to do it, I said this before, make sure you are going to an orthodontist. Um, for me, it was how much cheaper? It was either $1,500 $1, cheaper. Oh no, I'm lying. Okay, the total price would have been $15 cheaper, but what happened was, I think I've said this before, my actual dentist is out of network. I like her, I've been going to her for years, and I know she's expensive, Um, but she was only saying that my insurance was only covering like $700, and it wasn't true. When I got to the orthodontist place, they said nothing was covered. So I called and they was like, yeah, they covered 2000. So I only had to come out of my pocket $2,000 and then my insurance covered the other two. So it was 4,000 at the orthodontist. Listen, it's worth it guys. Um, let me know if you have them or had Invisalign and how your process went. Were you in a lot of pain? Um, also to the what is this? The little chewies? I didn't have to use them this time. I'm hoping all of my aligners are like this. Um, so I asked the, dent the orthodontist what made them choose this because they, they do both, but he says they're gearing towards spark. I'm assuming they get some sort of cut. But <laughs> I think um, he was saying to him, one, they're, they're clearer, and two, that the aligners go all the way up on the tooth and the spark aligners, but the Invisalign, they don't. So, this is just a quick video, guys. Um, just a quick video. I will show you guys what I have them, but I just have them like a little dress and a blazer today. Some simple earrings working from home. So, can you guys see? I'm looking over there. Uh, yeah, so this is the tooth over here and then they're gonna ship some stuff here now I my teeth are <laughs> I, I always say that I have thick teeth like my mom you ever seen someone's teeth and they look I don't even know if that's like a disorder so let me tread lightly where their teeth look kind of like transparent a bit um mine's are very very like opaque white um so if you are a person who really wants to get this, I would definitely say go for it. Um, if you have to get attachments, don't even worry about the attachments being on your teeth. Um, you can't really see them. I think I've, I'm a little bit better this time because I'm so used to it. And the reason why was because my retainers <laughs> for the last set, I was wearing them a lot. Like just cause I was so comfortable with it. Um, so now I got to go through this process of slight pain and I said this before make sure you're changing them at nighttime That way if there is some pain you're asleep, okay um, but other than that Yeah Let me see what else Yeah, I, I, I like them in there so far um, The only thing I don't like and this is gonna sound petty <laughs> But when you go to an orthodontist and they're taking out your aligners, first of all, I hate it, okay? And the reason why I hate it is because every time they take them out, I feel like they're scratching me somehow in, in my mouth, right? So what I'm gonna do the next time is take them out for them. Um, but other than that, I'm on week one. I have 10 weeks. Um, I'm almost 100% sure at the end of this, I'm not gonna need any more. If I did, it's just me being a pain and being anal, honestly. Um, but I think I'll be fine. Nobody's teeth are perfect. Even when you get braces, guys. Um, 
I do know that wearing your retainers are a must after doing this. I also need to double check how much, and I should have that information for you guys next time, how much it costs to buy retainers and how often do I have to change them. If you guys have any scoop on that, let me know. Um, you know, the retainers look just like the aligners. I almost low-key want the old ones because I feel like they probably last a little longer. I don't know, to me. But we'll see, because these are plastic. Um, I heard you change them every three months. I'm not 100% sure. So, but that's it, guys. So this is week, week one. <laughs> I had to think about it. Week one of 13. Oh, and let's just say 10 for the 10 full weeks. Um, and I'll keep you guys posted on this. Again, let me know if you guys have any questions. I don't post this on Instagram or anything like that. Um, but... Like I said, if you are interested, go to see an orthodontist. You will save money, um, and that's just what they do, right? You go to a dentist for cleanings and stuff like that, um, and all that other stuff, and just go to an orthodontist um, so you can get the best job done for your money, guys. Um, like I said, I love my regular dentist, but she pricey. <laughs> and I just knew that, actually, it was the, the hygienist girl. She told me, she was like, Go find somebody else. Um, but I, I'm glad I went to an orthodontist. It's pretty cool in there. So he's a cool um, doctor. So that was good. So let me know if you guys have any questions. This was just a quick little video on this. Nothing special. Just to give you guys an update. I did not forget that I needed to do this video for you guys for my next set of aligners. Um, I'm excited. I can't wait to just like be cheesing. <laughs> <laughs> and my teeth were never bad. The lighting is going in and out because it's sunny. My teeth were never bad, but you know, you always want nice teeth. Listen, I said this before. The older we get, your teeth start to shift. There's nothing we can really do about it. Um, and just invest in it. That's it. Your smile is everything. You know, I know I knew a girl that I worked with. Um, I didn't know that she had anything wrong with her teeth but the people at the job used to talk about her teeth and I was like the girl don't ever smile I have no idea what's wrong with her I don't know like I don't I never seen her teeth and she and I became cool and she told me that she had a lot of spaces so she ended up getting um not Invisalign veneers and they were really really pretty um so I was like well it was worth it you know she saved up her money and she did it so you know she knew that her smile would make her feel better. So do what makes you feel good, guys. Um, if you love your teeth, leave them as is. If you are in a pickle <laughs> with some money, <laughs> just save up for it. And hmm, my orthodontist had a payment plan, so did my dentist, but their payment plan was so much better. So if you, that could be another case too, Pay, uh, do a payment plan. Since they, since they paid, my insurance paid so much of it, I just kind of just like paid it or whatever. But if you are a person who really wants your teeth done and you are, you know, don't have the money like that, just go on a payment plan. Most of the time, it's no interest, which is great. So you can just pay it as you go and they give you a long time, depending on the place. So think about that, guys. And for anyone who is under 18, 18 and under, if you are watching this video, um, and your parents want you to get regular braces, tell them to look into Invisalign. It's good, you'll feel better about it, but you have to wear them 22 hours out the day, guys. Listen, I eat, okay? Um, and a friend of mine asked me, do I, uh, <laughs> what do I do by eating? I'm like, I still eat, but I brush and I pop, I pop them right back in. Um, and that's because they're shifting. They'll shift right back if you are not wearing them. Your aligners are going to feel tight. You don't want that. So that's it, guys. Let me know if you have any questions on the spark aligners. <laughs> and um, I will catch you guys in the next one. If you stay to the end of this video, please comment Coco. We see you. Guys, don't forget to subscribe to this channel. I am trying to hit a 1,000. And I know, let me not say a 1,000. Let me say, I'm trying to hit 1,500. Um... I want to do something really special just for you guys sticking it out with me. I know my channel is kind of like here and there sometimes like with different things. I'm really trying to honestly still really get a good handle on things, on things that 
excuse me, you guys want to see. And um, I want to put out good content for you guys, good quality and all that good stuff. Make sure you guys are getting benefits from things that I am talking about. I am by nature a helper, so this is why I style women. I just love to help people. <laughs> um, and if whatever I know, you guys will know, guys. So make sure you follow me on Instagram at Coco Styles NY and Coco Styles NYC and my personal blog, Coco Styles NYC, and my styling services website, CocoStylesNY.com. And I will catch you guys in the next one. Bye, guys.